Okay guys, let's go for new casting and this time we have Supe. Vika Supe is a really really old player which came back against Mr. Bot as set. So I will say you have advantage with set on this map, even though it's not a really high end map. But uh, just a simple fact that set can go like four minutes most of the time, and just instant grab a TC is just insane against North. And we see six five four for Supe and Mr. Bot is not gonna be right in time. It's gonna be a bit later than what's sets player do actually is even having two villagers to make house which isn't really the best it's just a waste of uh, one villager at this point so yeah he, he switched to the gold so it's he gonna aim for TC oh and that's where the I mean yeah I guess it's unlucky uh, unlucky um, map for for set at this point because he didn't find any really interesting stuff to, to convert so he didn't scoot quite well and he doesn't know about this giraffe here which could be really good for for Mr. Boat here to grab TC just and then go on this hunt and try to secure this side so he has hunt and gold so super this scoot the priest here because of the raven and the priest is gonna die for free we have the shifted sense but not gonna be good I mean still grab one two villager actually so never mind kill those card bro in Italy, that's all you. <laughs> I don't know why he, he backed instead of just keep eating the ox card and then you think the ox card was stuck. So you have to realize an ox card is like two villagers in terms of resource, even though it's 50 wood. And you can say this one super has two. He has two barracks, but he has literally no food income and he's not even gonna be close to, to have a lot of. In, of food in few seconds. I don't know why. He... So I guess no. Where is Mr. Oh, it's not even grabbing TC. What the fuck is that? Okay, that's really really strange. Could have grabbed easily a TC here, maybe just for the berries and for the giraffe. But instead, he just went for a barrack and makes spearman. Why not? But yeah, it's not all set. It has to be played, in my opinion. You have to abuse power of, I mean, the strength of, of set. So, Supe might go for husbandry quite soon. Nope, nope, no. he has a resource to get uh, husbandry, he has a lot of uh, 9 goats against 6 here. Uh -huh. this, yeah, this army might be scary. This army might be scary, but I think with some good micro Valkyrie won't last long. But yeah, there is five airs here, it's gonna be hard to 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 defend the uh, Wedjet here. Wedjet. Yeah, it's gonna die. And that's a lot of idle time. That's why you grab 
second TC has set, so you unitarily force what? Okay, I guess if, uh, <laughs> that is so bad. First fire here probably did almost nothing, I guess. But yeah, that's that's why you grab a you grab a TC because if you grab a TC like here or here, it forces Subway to have a lot of army to deny this or this because there is there will be this TC which which is here in case uh, Super Army is just too big now. So yeah, really not a big fan of Mr. Boat strategy here. And as you can see, there is a huge pop difference. At least he has more more villager, but that's probably because he killed two villager here and just made a lot of idle time, probably because Supe was trying to produce villager. But here you can see he's, he's gonna get his um, uh, how to say that. Okay, let me check. Let me check. Mm, yeah, it's delay, but that's not really what I meant. Yeah, maybe it's it's actually what what I meant, but I didn't know it's this word in English. But yeah, the delay he had with the villagers gonna get. Easily fixed by the second TC. You can see Mr. Boat went for uh, middle here from one TC uh, Neftis. And uh, I guess if Super just wanna just wanna go for for Eric, is gonna have really really strong push on that gold mine. Problem is, I don't think it's the right call for an Egyptian to say just one TC because it mean it, it meant that it, I mean, it means it means that uh, as Egyptian you might have all your army. I mean, as long as you don't attack, you will have all your army right close to your gold. And if the North player just freeze. All of that, it's gonna be really insane for him, and that's entirely uh, something you, you can't really let North do. And yeah, he's gonna grab Frost. So yeah, pretty much now Super just has to make barracks. I think he's making walls to try to to escape the ancestral eclipse. I mean the, the ancestor since it's set and it doesn't have eclipse, but yeah. Now he just has to spam a lot of army and just wait probably to get full power on two TC, and then just push with frost and the game is over. As you can see, he has three more villagers now. Two. Yeah, he just has to delay to wait the frost. Maybe he's gonna use it instantly now to to get enough time to get a nice amount of army. Yeah, here we go. He's gonna fight now because there is a frost. As you can see, Mr. Boy is kinda scared now. Priest really wrongly placed here. Mr. Boat really needs his priest alive to deal with uh, the frost giant. Okay, we have shadow fear. Uh, I guess it's probably better to, to pick funeral uh, rights because uh, yeah, frost. Uh, I mean, frost giants are coming. Uh, I lost. Super lost a house, but yeah. And I rebuild, maybe he's going for heavy uh, cavalry. No, never mind. 
Yeah, just a, a frost, maybe not here, just before, just after destroying the wall, but you take. Yeah, that's probably why what uh, Boat is expecting here is trying to split his villager, but getting close to, to his army, so he won't get idle villager. So we got in 4 2. Okay. Oh no, never mind. Actually, it's, I think he's gonna grab, t grab the TC, but Super is just gonna try to red. Yeah, awkward to to, <laughs> to go for uh, an uh, an house here. We got Ulsark, Minus Carl, and he's not producing anything here. Oh yeah, should freeze the siege tower. Never mind, he missed. Uh, the pharaoh, the pharaoh. Yeah, that's awkward that he's not trying to produce on these two barracks. I don't know. Uh, there's no market. He also has quite low food economy, even though he has five entering and no berries anymore. Ah, he's getting Amory braids, that's why. That's why he uses some of his food. And also heavy infantry, which is gonna be quite good. Even though the Trying X Man not gonna be really strong against uh, Ancestor and Eclipse, I mean Ancestor. And chariots, but as you can see, this uh, trying X Man is just gonna be free DPS with uh, frost coming, and I guess I guess Super is gonna clean a lot of army here. Even though he is focusing minion actually right now, so not the best. Second hill fort, okay. Oh, that's nice red right here. And yeah, Super has. Oh, damn, Super has a lot of idle time here. <laughs> so yeah, Super has um, only one. One, one uh, spot of gold actually. So this red was quite worse, but oh, the three chats are gonna die. Oh damn, nice funeral. No, we don't have funeral rights. Okay, it's on the way. So I think at this point, Supe should probably on CC's funeral rights, he should probably just stop making four giants because they're just gonna fall like paper with only three priests. Oh nice red here. Oh there was more rays actually that I missed and yeah you can see a huge population difference <laughs> well poor raider just literally died and yeah Migdal is gonna fall Another one is gonna get built here. But that's huge win for Supe. Just stacking economy, getting bow, so he should probably get <laughs> an ox card for that. Grabbing also 30 C, 45 ton center, yeah. I don't see how Supe can lose that. Doesn't even have plo. Nice to kill the Oxcar, uh, actually. And yeah, that, that will delay quite nicely because uh, Super is 
it's researching um, fortified town center in this city. But I think yeah, I think Nita is we can just roll into Mr. Boat base at this point. Yeah, just training with gold because of that ox card. You got the rhyme and on the way. That I really like, but yeah. Those five priests just gonna rape them right now with funeral white. Just need to protect them. Boom. Boom. <laughs> yeah, poor frost giant. Yeah, 70. Could, could be a nice Ragnarok. <laughs> but at this point, I think tier, tier will be will do really great here because Mr. Boat economy is quite... Uh, it's quite not that here. <laughs> As you can see, Frost Giants are just falling so easily. I think he's probably some well 100%, but I'm not sure. I do like double damage with funeral rights. I'm not sure if it's double or triple. We're yeah, preparing to grab this TC, but it's lacking of gold. I guess he could just make market to get the gold. Uh, Grab the TC at this point. But yeah, the problem is Mr. Bot Italy has no army. I mean, it just has few priests that's, uh, that are quite very strong against the uh, mythic units, but then he's just spamming child archer, heavy chariots, but yeah. He has no mid chill. So he's just gonna lose all his army again and again. While Supe just gonna make his strong economy. So yeah, actually Supe can really afford to lose all his army just to get to buy enough time and just boom. And those jars are just really strong. We can try just to tank. Jarl and Uska. Really strong from Odin. You can see TC does like 5 damage max. I won't even die. <laughs> That's so strong. And yeah, for TC, we're getting the uh, harvest, the winter harvest, carpenters, just mine. There is a market though. Thundering Hooves, uh, Heavy Cavalry, Land Wanderer, LOL. I guess Supe is just aiming for full, uh, full upgrades. Uh, 91, pretty good. Pretty good indeed.
query C mythic or not. No query, copper mail. And yeah, that's GG because literally Mr. Bolt let Supe does what he wants. What he wants and that's how it goes. So second game we have Oden against the so this on this map on frozen waste. Uh, it's gonna be a rush, probably, from Mr. Bolt. It's two gold mine actually, it didn't pay attention. And yeah, not the best here. This one is maybe slightly better, but still quite uh, readable. <laughs> Let's go, we have five minutes advance almost. Weird. We have six. Five, five. Okay. And we have almost four thirty for Mr. Boat with uh, nine five three yeah. standard one. I mean ten because this one was making a house. So I guess we will see some barrack and um, archery range right here. Yeah, four thirty. Because when you're Zeus and you're hunting forward like that, you, you need to make them right here. You made instant Odysseus and Jason, which is good. I guess he's gonna bolt the Valkyrie as always. Okay, I don't think Super is gonna aim for that. He kept a uh, nice amount of hunt here in base, so he's gonna go in base, probably. Okay, that was a bit slow to get the archery range. We will see the bolt here. Oh no. Yes, I, <laughs> I think... Well, actually I don't know. I think Mr. Bolt is going to just get bored of chasing that and just going to bolt. But so far Super, Super is in good position here because he, he, has, he has a really safe hunt and a nice amount of hunt. Uh, how much is that? 7, 12, uh, it's, so it's uh, 12, uh, 12, it's uh, 1,000 and and 600 that's what no what I'm saying it's uh no it's right yeah it's it's 600 <laughs> so yeah it's quite a lot just to get uh, Eric in time I mean Eric, not in time but save Eric more Just about that gun mine. I, uh, I thought it would have tried to roll here and here just to save some time in case there is an army here, but no, nope, not really. And the advantage is he can just literally let like uh, seven or eight dwarf and just keep making villager because he has so much food here and so much food from the goats also. Yeah, that's the problem when you don't bolt a fucking Valkyrie. You get raked by a fire, by a forest fire, but eventually it, has, it didn't kill any villager. You still have some low villager here and here. And yes, yeah, this, this Redding Carry knows. And yeah, Valkyrie is back, and you see this villager is dead. Ah, oh, never mind. So yeah, at this point just bolt it at start and don't get wrecked for nothing. This is just gonna die. And a second villager, so at this point it's huge, it's really huge for Odin. But there is still the pressure with a nice army and restoration. We have pickaxe as boundary, of course. 
So making dwarf knows as well. I think Shupe should stop making dwarf, just go for for villager and just get the tower upgrades. Or maybe it's just already done now. Because the tower upgrade is gonna be helpful to, to secure that gold mine and I mean not secure but help at least to defend and this one too. And this one can just get worship and protect them. Okay, really nice red here again. And the advantage with Odin is as long as you don't lose army, you can just try to heal them. Just make them have to beat. But as you can see, it's really huge. Really huge lose here for Mr. Boat. Yeah, I should have probably get them out to help, but yeah. Way too much villagers are dying right now. And he didn't do anything here because Supe just went back on that gold mine. He got the watchtower, which I like at this point. When those two died. But yeah, huge, huge, huge red for Supe at this point. Mr. Boat is really struggling with the food. A bit late for the armory because he already has the resources to to advance, but not a big deal. And even more since Supe, uh, since uh, Mr. Boat isn't trying to do anything, he could probably try to take down the temple to at least uh, grab some. Uh, I mean, force Supe to just rebuild it. Six, seven, nine, and a lot. Uh, Eleven here, only five, only one. The fuck. Okay, I guess he switched all his villager to food. All his gold villager at will. But yeah, Skadin on the way. Super so just has to spam. Army and yeah, so we can literally easily fight this. We have low opletes, low hit points, opletes, and yeah, all of them are gonna die, and he won't even lose one reading cavalry. Big win again. Okay, TC is focusing on Minotaur, yeah, he's gonna die. Pretty good for Super also. Super should care, but I guess he's gonna use it now. Here we go. Meanwhile, he still has a lot of reading carry, just annoying Mr. Boat. And now he's just gonna spam army. And Super is all good. Not sure the restoration is gonna be enough for Mr. Boat to, to win the fight. And in case, I think Supe could just sandwich this army with his riding cavalry. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> Supe just trying to dodge Quinnelation, which is impossible. <laughs> That's nice. I can see this. Hope it's gonna die. No, it's not gonna die yet. Restoration is being cast, but that won't be enough. There's literally no army left. Only toxicities. Yeah, GG. GG's here. Look at the population. Yes, literally six. Population on army. What? Uh, at this point, I will have resigned as to as Mr. Boat. 
because it's not like I mean Mr. Bird should have realized he, he didn't do any damage pretty much and he just lost all his army and one uh, god power and he's gonna lose all this tree building so yeah not really sure why you've sat to him maybe you misclick but yeah we will see probably Dionysos here Yep. <coughs> tuck, tuck, tuck. Okay, it's same same make of green actually. As you can see on the on the texture on the mod pretty much the or the interface I don't know what to say but you can see the little line which said there is crenellation and it also works for turn center but there is no light actually so yeah I'm just gonna wait the end of uh, of Mr. Boat. <coughs> A medium infantry for Supena. And the problem is, it was just gonna be useless here because uh, there are frost giant. Second TC4 Supe is just controlling about around the map, I guess. So knows about this gamma, this one too. Actually, they have the same amount of villager, which is quite surprising. But I guess it's because Super has a huge army and he wasn't even able to make more Viager for a moment. Yes, yeah, so at this Epas piece is just gonna be just gonna get raked by a uh, train X map. Okay, we have the bronze. We have Hydra getting freezed by Mr. Frost Giant. Not producing on this barrack, what the fuck? Oh, we have heavy cavalry for Super now. Oh, that's sad. <laughs> One pot toxicity is stuck in the building. But yeah, 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 yeah. I don't think the bronze will be now. You can see this army is quite scary. I think just super just gonna wait for uh, the bronze to get out or just to fight uh, under fire of the town center and ill fought. And it's literally, Mr. Bosch shouldn't take that fight. It's like he's not even producing any more military. So yeah, expected 
And he has a GG. So yes, I don't think we had really hard time here. I guess maybe the two gold mine we are just handling Mr. Bull too much to, to put really strong pressure. I mean he could when when he when he destroyed that tower, I guess he could have just go around that forest, take down that tower and just make uh, super lost his uh plus, I mean makes super get some inner time on, on his uh, dwarf and stuff. But not no, no, actually, was, oh, this really was good, and this one too. <laughs> yeah, I hope you like it, boys, and I'll see you next time.